Hello there, my name is Brother Raymond and we want to thank you for all of your likes and your thumbs up. And for all you newcomers out of Facebook, thank you for spending your time with us. This is the only way you can reach us via Facebook or Rumble. We're on YouTube, but we operate right out of Rumble. This is Ray and D's Power Station. Today's podcast is called Seven Trumpets. Podcast number 34, Talk going to be reading from Revelation chapter 8 and we're going to go back to Revelation chapter 1 just to set it up. Revelation chapter 1 The revelation of Jesus Christ which God gave to him to show to his servants things which must shortly come to pass. And he sent and signified it by his angel to his servant John, who bore record of the word of God and of the testimony of Jesus Christ and of all things that he saw. Blessed is he that reads and they that hear the words of this prophecy and keep those things which are written therein for the time is at hand did you hear that folks so you're blessed if you read what's in this book the book of revelation you know what's coming in the future and you know how to prepare when we looked up uh, this topic in google talks about Revelation 8 verses 1 through 2. It states that the angels sound the trumpets after the seventh seal is broken, which secured the apocalyptic document held in the right hand of the one city on the throne. Revelation 8. And when he had opened the seventh seal, there was silence in heaven about the space of half an hour. And I saw seven angels which stood before God, and to them were given seven trumpets. And another angel came and stood at the altar having a golden censer, and there was given to him much incense, that he should offer it with the prayers of all saints upon the golden altar which was before the throne. And the smoke of the incense which came with the prayers of the saints ascended up before God out of the angel's hand. And the angel took the censer and filled it with fire of the altar and cast it into the earth. And there were voices and thunderings and lightnings and an earthquake. And the seven angels which had the seven trumpets prepared themselves to sound. So in this point in time, something bad is about to happen. Yeah, so we'll continue. The first angel sounded, and there followed hail and fire mingled with blood, and they were cast upon the earth, and the third part of the trees was burnt up, and all green grass was burnt up. Now, I'm going to go back. So there's a ceiling of the 144,000 first. If you go back to chapter 7, Revelation chapter 7, it talks about that. I'll read it. And after these things, I saw four angels standing on the four corners of the earth, holding the four winds of the earth, that the wind should not blow on the earth, nor on the sea, nor on any tree. And I saw another angel ascending from the east, having the seal of the living God. And he cried with a loud voice to the four angels, to whom it was given to hurt the earth and the sea. Could these four angels be a part of the seven? We're going to read it's a part of investigating what the Lord is saying in this book. Revelation chapter 7, verse 3. Here we go. 
saying, Hurt not the earth, neither the sea, nor the trees, till we have sealed the servants of our God in their foreheads. And I heard the number of them which were sealed, and there were sealed a hundred and forty and four thousand of all the tribes of the children of Israel. So now we're back to Revelation 8, verse 7. The 144,000 have been sealed. So we have to figure out where we are on the, on the uh, timetable. The first angel sounded, and there followed hail and fire mingled with blood, and they were cast upon the earth. And the third part of the trees was burnt up. And all green grass was burnt up. And the second angel sounded, and as it were, a great mountain burning with fire was cast into the sea, and the third part of the sea became blood. And the third part of the creatures which were in the sea and had life died, and the third part of the ships were destroyed. And the third angel sounded and there fell a great star from heaven burning as it were a lamp and it fell upon the third part of the rivers and upon the fountains of waters and the name of the star is called wormwood and the third part of the waters became wormwood and many men died of the waters because they were made bitter and the fourth angel sounded and the third part of the sun was smitten let me stop right there so if we go back to Re revelation 8 verse 8 it says um and the second angel sounded and as it were a great mountain burning with fire was cast into the sea and the third part of the sea became blood and the third part of the creatures which were in the sea and had life died and the third part of the ships were destroyed. This, is this a burning volcano, a burning mountain, a fire, a volcano that's about to erupt? Maybe if we see this burning mountain, the 144,000 have been sealed. Well, this is what we're saying. They say that this Bible is a record book. We're going to continue. And the fourth angel sounded, and the third part of the sun was smitten, and the third part of the moon, and the third part of the stars, so as the third part of them was darkened, and the day shone not for a third part of it, and the night likewise. And I beheld and heard an angel flying through the midst of the heaven, saying with a loud voice, Woe, 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 to the inhabitants of the earth by reason of the other voices of the trumpet of the three angels which are yet to sound. So uh, are, are these the four angels that were mentioned uh, in Revelation 7, where it says, let's go there, Revelation 7, Verse 2, And I saw another angel ascending from the east, having the seal of the living God. And he cried with a loud voice to the four angels, yeah, these must be the four angels, to whom it was given to hurt the earth and the sea, yeah, saying, Hurt not the earth, neither the sea, nor the trees, till we have sealed the servants of our God in their foreheads. And I heard the number of them which were sealed, and there were sealed a hundred and forty and four thousand. You can go to podcasts, uh, the previous podcast that talks about the one hundred forty-four thousand. Well, my name is Brother Raymond, and you've been listening to Ray and D's Power Station. This is been podcast number thirty-four. Talk. Seven trumpets. We will continue. We only got up to four angels with four trumpets.
See you next week.